In the Pacific region, education is key to building strong democratic societies. But without reliable data, many Pacific Island countries can't make good policy making and planning decisions that can improve the quality of education. That's where the Pacific Community's Educational Quality and Assessment Program, or ECAP, comes in. The ECAP has created the Status of Pacific Education Report, which aims to improve the quality, availability, and use of statistical information for education policy making and management. The Status of Pacific Education Report was required for reporting on the MEL component of the Pacific Regional Education Framework, 2018 to 2030. In 2021, the Forum Education Ministers' Meeting endorsed the report and committed to achieving the Sustainable Development Goal 4 targets and PECREF outcomes by 2030. In 2023, the Pacific Heads of Education Systems agreed to present the 2022 report at the inaugural conference of Pacific Education Ministers' Meeting, which approved the release of the report to inform development partners, stakeholders and the public about official statistics on education in the Pacific. The 2022 report contains 23 indicators related to four policy areas of the Pacific Regional Education Framework which include out-of-school rate. While the Pacific region has made progress with only 7% of children out of school, it's still higher than the regional target of 5% for primary age students. Early Childhood Education Participation Rate Less than 72% of Pacific children enrolled in early childhood education compared to the 2030 regional benchmark of 93%. Minimum proficiency in literacy and numeracy. Fewer primary children are meeting minimum proficiency levels in numeracy, with only 75% of Year 6 students meeting the expected standard, which is lower than the target of 85% by 2030. The report also tracks the proportion of trained teachers. While efforts have been made to increase the number of trained teachers at primary and secondary levels, there is still a gap between the current values and the 2030 regional benchmark of 100%. But the report is only the beginning. To promote trust in education statistics, the report needs to be shared widely. The Pacific Data Hub has an education dashboard that provides information about the thematic SDG4 indicators by country and gender in the Pacific region. By visiting the Pacific Data Hub website, policymakers and stakeholders can access the dashboard and use this information to make informed decisions about education at different levels, from local to global. By working together, we can improve the quality of education in the Pacific region and build a stronger, more democratic society for all. This research was carried out by ECAP's Education Data Team in collaboration with the UNESCO Institute for Statistics. Audio.